Hey, welcome back to Cool Guitar and let's draw our Primo from Brawl Stars. So let's get started with a quick sketch and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this and this one is pretty simple and has pretty cool looking uh, wrestler. So we're gonna start out with his eyes which is just gonna be two circles. So I'm just gonna draw one. Then come to the other side, draw the other one. And it's pretty big. Okay, so there's no details to it. And then after that, we're going to draw in his nose. Just going to be right in the middle, right in between the eye. Just make a little angle like this and let's close it off. So nice and simple. And then from here, we're going to draw part of his mask uh, right above his lip. So just right underneath the eyeball right here on the side. Just gonna come across first, and then I'm gonna come down and draw his mouth. So right in the middle, you can make a little point, and then I'm gonna curve up this way, almost to the to the side of that uh, that line there. And then another curve, and then from there I'm gonna draw the bottom. And this is just gonna be one big bowl shape. All right, and then to finish this off, we're gonna draw in some details. So just on the corner here, I'm gonna draw two curves. And let me shade it in so we can see it a little bit better. So the white part is gonna be his teeth. And we can add in one little line in the middle and then come off to the side. Then we're just gonna add two more little lines for his teeth. Okay, and then from there we're gonna draw um, Keep coming down on the side here to finish off his mask around his mouth area. And then once you have that, I'm just gonna close it with a slight curve. Okay, so now we can finish up the uh, the whole uh, headgear. So come to the side here. I'm gonna come down. So this part's easy. We just kind of come straight down. And close this off. So that's going to finish off with a mask on the side. And then for the top, which is going to be one big curve, almost like a semicircle. All right, so that's pretty much the, the head shape and some details on this mask. So in the middle, right on the forehead here, I'm going to draw one curve, a little bit higher on this side. And then from the corner here, just draw two little curves going in. And then once you have that, just round it off, finish off that. Just close it, everything off. All right, and then lastly, there's going to be a little bit of detail here. So I'm going to curve in from the side. So this is going to be slightly different color and then just curve it back out. So we're not going to see most of it because it's on the side. And then once you have that curve, just come in the middle here, just curve it out. So it's going to be yellow and this one's going to be green. All right, so that's the head and let's move on to the body. So for his neck here on the side, we're going to come down. And we're going to try to make him a little bit muscular. And then right underneath that, just draw Two little curves like this. Okay, and then for his shoulders from his mask, let's curve down. All right, and then we're gonna draw in his chest muscle here. So come down here, leave a little bit of space. Just slant it in. And then we're gonna come all the way across. All right, and then for his uh, waist area here, we're gonna come down. And then from here, we're gonna draw, he's got a pretty big belt here. So from this corner here, draw one big, kind of like a half circle. And then whatever you have here, just close it off. That's gonna be the top of his belt. And then for his belt, we're gonna extend it. And then come straight down 
it's gonna be nice and thick and then come across and close everything off and then to finish off the uh, details on the belt here I'm just gonna draw one circle right in the center and then let's draw in the little skull shape in here so another kind of like a half circle and then come in we'll keep it simple and then just come straight down and then close it so it's almost like a mushroom shape actually and then for the little eye sockets here just two little circles okay so now we can draw in let's draw in his arm and this one's gonna be uh, a different position so let's draw in this one first so from the shoulder a little curve here's the armpit from the chest area I'm gonna draw one line and then from the outside here just gonna curve it all the way out here so this is gonna be his elbow and then we come down here that's gonna be his bicep and then just come across with a short little line Okay, and then once you have that from this corner here, just go straight to the belt. And then from this corner here, here's his elbow. Just kind of curve it in. And then come down here. So this is gonna be, uh, his hand's gonna be folded inward. Just curve this and just go behind that line. So we're gonna keep it simple. All right, and then the other side, we're gonna have him flexing a little bit. So right here, this is gonna be his shoulder. Here's his bicep. Here's the armpit. And then this part's gonna go all the way out here. It's gonna be his elbow. Okay, and then now we can draw in his forearm. So from this point, we can just kind of go up and then from this point here, we're going to curve it and just kind of meet up to that area right around there. And then now we can draw in his fist. So for his fist, we can draw one curve here. We're going to draw another curve. I know it's a little bit weird. <laughs> and then just go up. And then just close this off, round it off. And then from this corner here, we're gonna continue it. Just draw a little curve like that. So this is actually gonna be his little pinky. All right, and then from there, we're just gonna draw in his thumb right here. So this one's easy, just come down. Just hook it up. All right, so that's the upper body and let's move on down to his legs, which are gonna be really simple. So from the center here, I'm gonna draw one little line Come back out to the side here. Come down and go back to the center here. Come down and then close it off. Slight angle going up. And then the other side. Slant. It's gonna be the same thing. All right, and then for his boot, we're gonna extend this line just a little bit. This one's gonna come straight down. This one's gonna stop short a little bit. And then from this point here, just draw one curve going up. Then you meet up to that, come back down, close it off. Okay, so extend. Slant it down, you use the other side for reference. Come down, and then same thing here, dome shape, all the way up and come back down, and then close it off. And then lastly for the little detail here, it's kind of an X. So this one's easy, I'm just going to draw an X on both sides and I'll make it a little bit thicker since I'm using a Sharpie, so this is nice and easy.
And that is it for this El Primo. Hope you guys liked the way it turned out. And if you do, please check out my other videos. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you next time.